Hi, I'm Carrie Obazinski, Times Business Development Manager. Welcome to Real Times. This is our vlog where we'll talk about industry trends, ask the experts some questions, talk about new products, pretty much everything coax. Please subscribe to our channel, and if you'd like to get updates on our new episodes, just click the bell. Today we have with us John Muzio. He's the product manager and applications engineer for our test and measurement cable line. And today we're gonna to talk about VNAs. And the reason we did um, VNAs was, I asked John, what's a VNA? And he's like, well, what a great subject for us to talk about. So John, what's a VNA? <laughs> Well, Carrie, thanks for having me up today. Thank you for coming. Yeah. So uh, VNAs, uh, basically it stands for network, um, Vector Network Analyzer. See, I can't say it either. Vector <laughs> Network Analyzer. That's there great. you go. Thank you. Um, so what we could do that with a, a VNA is we can do various different S parameter type of measurements. Now these are measurements that are critical to show uh, different phase relationships, how the, the device under test is performing through an RF type of world. So who would use these VNAs? What type of industries or markets? You know, military, aerospace, semiconductor, uh, medical type things. Um, most of these uh, companies that are developing RF based products will utilize a VNA to be able to test whatever hardware they're developing or as a system as a whole to see how it's performing. Okay, so we don't sell VNAs, but we sell cable assemblies for the VNAs? That's correct. Okay. Right. So we work with various different VNA manufacturers out there uh, to develop um, all of our test and measurement cable lines to be able to work with VNAs. So we're looking at uh, making phase stable type of uh, cables. Now that's very, very important because one of the things you're measuring when you're doing S curves and things like that with a VNA is you're looking how this thing performs in the RF world. So phase becomes extremely important. Um, so we make it uh, then very, very uh, stable. We also make them with all the different connectors that are required, required for different VNAs out there. Uh, and be able to hook up all the various different types of uh, devices under test. Okay, so we sell the cable assemblies. Now, if someone's interested in these cable assemblies, do we have a product line name for them? Right. So um, basically, any of our test and measurement cables will work with the VNAs. So starting at the bottom, we have Silverline Extra Flex. We have Silverline Standard. We also have Clarity which even gets very, very focused on how performance on phase with VNA interaction. Then we take it a step farther and we actually have Silverline VNA, uh, which starts at 40 gigahertz and can go all the way up to 110 gigahertz. So what's so special about the Silverline product line? Right, so it's the method of construction it's also the connectors that we designed specifically for uh, Silverline test cables. It's the materials that are being utilized. So, you know, uh, the whole Silverline Clarity and Silverline VNA are very, very focused on construction, materials, and keeping that stability and accuracy. Uh, we also have to be concerned with, uh, you know, a term called um, uh, VSWR. Um, so that's a voltage wave standing ratio. So what that means is, you know, we want to be able to input a signal and have as little reflections as possible. So once again, the materials, how it's constructed, the connector types, uh, be able to eliminate those type of unwanted effects. So that's why we actually make the cable assemblies for the customers. That's correct. Okay. Yes. Um, yeah. So we couldn't just be able to provide, you know, a kit and build it yourself because you can run into a lot of reflection issues, phase stability issues and stuff if it's not built correctly. Well, thank you for explaining VNAs to us today. I appreciate it. And it sounds like we have a full product line of solutions for our customers as far as test and measurement equipment are concerned. Absolutely. All right, thank you, John. Thank you. 
Real Times is your place to talk with the experts, learn about some of our new products, and talk about RF technologies. Subscribe again to our YouTube channel and click the bell if you'd like to get updates on our new episodes. And if you have a question for John, myself, or another engineer at our company, please email us uh, below at realtimes at timesmicro.com. That's R-E-E-L. And finally, um, if you liked this, please share it and like it. And until next time, thank you for watching.